welcome to a new tutorial. Today I'm gonna show you how to import an external list here on Mailing Boss. Okay. Um, the first thing is that you need to know which fields you want to import here. I'm gonna go to my phone number one list. Okay, and then I'm gonna go to uh, subscribers. Okay, then we're gonna go to fields. Uh, this is the the most common fields that you can have on a on a list right the name and the email but if it's for some reason you have uh, several other fields like um, a form prefix or you have any other information that you have on the list you want to also import that information here okay you need to create here first the field by creating and selecting any of the options here okay and put a tag you have to remember the tag. The tag are very import, important when you want to import a list here on Mailing Boss. Um, the other thing you have to keep in mind is that the arrangement you have to make on the CSV file or the TXT file, so you can import it here. You can go into export. Okay. You can go to subscribers. Okay. And you can create a new subscriber and add yourself here. You can see that I have my my name and my email here okay and i already i'm added on my list and confirm okay and if i go to export and i export the field the the, the list you'll see the amount of fields okay if you have more fields you have to check them all if you want to export the list using um all all the the fields if you want to export the list only using the email just unclick name you export the list just with the email okay but I'm gonna use first name and email and then when we're gonna click on start export it's gonna download automatically a zip file on your computer so you can open and check the CSV file so it's, it's gonna look like this um, the first field that we have okay it's gonna it's gonna go again to export the first, the, the first field that we have is the name. So we're going to put here the tag on it to know, to know which tag that I have on my, on my first name or my name field. I have to go to fields again. Okay. And the first tag that I'm using is F name. So it should be F name, comma, and the next field, which is email. Okay. And the tag for the email is email. Okay. If I have another field, which it could be phone number. Okay, here I can just add phone number or phone. Okay, depending on the tag you use for the phone number field. Okay, you have to keep in mind that this is the right format to import a list here on Maybe Boss. Okay, so it should look like this: Miguel, which is the the name, the email, okay, and the phone number. Okay, so. All the information will be on a single column. Okay. So if we have more subscriber, it should be like this. Okay. Just save your um, your list as a C CSV file. Okay, like this. If you have several options here and you have to like create this file manually, you have to do it or try to use the Excel options to create just a single line. On a, on a column okay with the information but you have to keep in mind that this is the arrangement you have to create first name second email and if you have more fields you can add more fields here okay so just save the file go back to mainly boss and click on import okay it's gonna ask you if you if your list has more of 10,000 or it has less so does the list you want to import have 10,000 contacts or less yes it does have uh less than 1000 okay so we're gonna go to yes and we have to choose the csv file in any case that we have more than 1000 of subscribers you have to fill a contact form you have to wait for approval because um with more than 1000 subscribers you have to wait until our team check your request okay just choose the file Choose the file you want to import. I'm gonna select uh, select a list that I have already. Okay, open file. It's gonna automatically load that I have just one subscriber. 
and I can go back to my list overview. So if I go to subscriber, you will see that I have this new subscriber that I just added. You can see that it doesn't have any IP address because it was imported. And I have my 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 subscriber here because the list just contain one just one subscriber. Okay? That will be all. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe.